As an armchair adventurer, I love the excitement and immersion of action sports cinematography. Aerial drone cameras can add a level of scale and dimensionality that's truly awesome. But successful piloting to get those epic shots is no easy task. That's why one California company is creating a smarter drone. I'm Arjun Dutt with NVIDIA, and this is IMAI. The team at Skydio is developing AI technology to pilot its autonomous drone, the R1. I caught up with their CEO to find out more. Yeah, so the, the initial idea was really very simple. Like, we looked out and saw all the cool concepts that people were excited about with drones. Um, but we just felt like there was a huge gap between what people wanted to do and what was possible with existing products. But most of the things that seem like they're going to be really valuable and exciting in the long run rely on the drone being able to fly itself. Uh, and that is a set of really hard technical problems, but it's stuff that we knew a lot about, we loved working on. Um, and it just felt like there was a huge opportunity if we could do a good job on it. Are you going to show me this thing? Yeah. Uh, so we have the Skydio R1 here. Oh, man. That thing is tiny. So there's a lot going on here, but the key thing is it's been built for full autonomy from the ground up. So it actually has 13 cameras on it. So it has eight around the perimeter. Wow. And it has two on top, two on bottom. And then this is the user video camera. So this is what captures the video that the user actually gets. So this is 4K, high quality. Um, and the rest of the cameras are used for, for visual navigation. Do you need to be able to trust the drone to fly itself? That's just like a fundamental basic capability mm -hmm. that we think opens up a new world of possibilities. You need to have a three-dimensional understanding of the world, which comes from the perception and the computer vision. But then you also need to know what to do given all that information. In order for the drone to figure out what it should do, it actually predicts about four seconds into the future. It looks at what the person around it is gonna do. It looks at the structure of the environment and then it uses all that information to figure out where it can go to fly in a safe and useful way. So how does the R1 navigate through the real world and keep up with its subject? Skydio uses a convolutional neural network to locate people in the images from the main video camera. The R1 then builds a unique visual identifier that lets it stay aligned to the selected subject. It then uses additional neural networks and geometric algorithms to build a three-dimensional understanding of the subject and its environment. The R1's understanding of the subject is further enhanced through the use of a recurrent neural network. The network uses previous states to predict the motion of the subject up to four seconds in advance to plan an ideal flight path. We do have a lot of data on our drone that we really need to make sense of in order to avoid obstacles and track the subject and plan a path in a small amount of time there between frames. Um, and so we do that using an onboard NVIDIA TX1 processor that allows us to have both a CPU and a GPU in order to compute where things are in the world really efficiently in a very small amount of time. So we build up a 3D map and run neural networks on the GPU and that allows us to do things in parallel very efficiently. So how does AI and autonomy make for a safer drone? It's a tricky balance between pushing the state of technology and having it be actually robust and trustworthy enough to put in the hands of a consumer or a business. We're built from the ground up around enabling autonomy. If we can show that flying around people and around obstacles and we, we have the technology to be safe, more of these types of things can be enabled and open up industries. There's a tremendous amount of complexity in flight, in flying systems, in taking cool video. Really what we've tried to do here is use AI to manage all of that complexity with our AI software system such that the end user experience is, is really simple, really powerful. I think the thing that's really most exciting to us is we're really just at the beginning of this journey. Our vision for drones is that they should be sleek, super intelligent, beautiful flying assistants that we're comfortable using every day for all kinds of interesting, cool stuff. 